back with another comparison video. This time, it's all about breakfast. Breakfast sandwich battle. All right, so we have the McDonald's Bacon and Egg McMuffin coming in at $4.79 with a whopping 310 calories. Dun dun dun. A and W English muffin bacon and egger coming in at four dollars and fifty nine cents, but three hundred and seventy calories. Mmm. So you're saving like twenty cents, but you're gaining a whole bunch of calories. I'm actually shocked that a and W is cheaper than McDonald's. McDonald's, what y'all doing out there? Well, since McDonald's is the granddaddy of fast food and their Egg McMuffin has been around for, let's say decades, presumably. Since the dawn of time. Dawn of time. <laughs> let's try that one first. Um, we'll open it up. Let's so get a quick peek at it. Yeah, get let's a close see. Let's up. In case no one's seen an Egg McMuffin. Well, you know. This uh, is what it looks like, it all right. depends on how it's made. I was gonna say, it's, it's a little beat up. Not so, it's toasted. You can tell the edges are a little bit black. Toasty. It has the egg. It's a little smooshy, but that's okay. Oh, it looks like the yolk's a little... A little dry a little there. Little... The egg, the cheese, and what about that bacon, guys? Did McDonald's bring the bacon? <laughs> I was gonna say, where is the bacon? There's one piece of bacon, everybody. One piece of bacon! McDonald's, McDonald's is notoriously chintzy with their bacon. Yeah, you know what the, most expensive, what the most expensive piece in this uh, sandwich probably is. Eric still has nightmares about the lack of bacon McDonald's that, gives. They kill me. All right, let's give this one a go. Cheers, everybody. There we go. Mm. That was aggressive. Well, it would help if I could get a bite of bacon. I'm pretending to get a bacon that bite. You did? No. Oh. I did a trick. I, the bacon runs horizontally, so I ate it like that. Mine's just kind of curled up. I mean, it's the microwave bacon. Yeah. It has that microwave bacon taste. It's good, I mean, the egg is fine, the cheese is fine, the bun's like toasty. Yeah, the English, the English muffin tastes good. Yeah, oh, I did get a little, little piece, I got like a corner of the bacon, I think, there on my bite. I mean, it tastes good, like, I, I got nothing really bad to say about this. Another piece of bacon would be nice McDonald's. That's... You know what, for what it is, it, it's good. Let's compare it to the a and W English muffin bacon and egger. I have never ever had uh, this from A and W. No, if you guys neither. Have. No, neither. No. Yeah, I've had plenty of egg muffins, but never had this. But right away, though, let's see. Oh, the English yeah. muffin oh. is the same, but the egg looks not like that preformed circle egg that they kind of yeah. put in. Yeah, it looks like actual. Fr it looks fried like egg. they actually fried it. Wow, that's kind of cool. Just oh, a yeah. fried egg on a grill. Yeah, and look you can at just, that. Like, fold in half. Like, Three pieces of bacon, uh, people. They already killed it in bacon. Three here. pieces of bacon. bacon. Oh yeah, and Is it's there, cheaper. Anything underneath the egg on the other side. But look at the eggs folded. Like that's huge. Yeah, it's just a wow. big egg. Wow. Oh, yeah, look, look, look. This covers the whole bun Holy with bacon. Look at Eric's, Eric's in bacon heaven over there. This cover. This is what I'm looking for, McDonald's. This is it. But I love. Cover the whole. Bun I, in bacon. I love the fried egg. Like, look at how big that is. Yeah, like that's just an egg folded in half. It's not. They actually made it. It'll it, be interesting. It looks, it, it looks heftier already. It'll be interesting because there's no sauces on these, so it's literally the exact same ingredients. Anyway, <laughs> let's go. <laughs> Cheers, everybody. Mm. Oh my god. The bacon on this is so much better than the McDonald's bacon. Mm -hmm. Right away you can tell. Because there's more of it. So you oh. get a bunch. And it's not microwave bacon. No. That's what I was going to say. It's actually properly grilled bacon. Mm. And it's, it's saltier. It's delicious. This thing is a savory goddess. I love and the this. egg, this is really good. And it's, like I said, it's hilarious because it's literally the exact same ingredients. It's the exact same sandwich. Oh, 100% it is, but wow. The night and day difference. It's that bacon, man. Wow, it did taste oh good. Oh my god. Do you like the bacon? Fan freaking tastic chef kiss. It's a night and day difference in taste, considering it's, it's exactly the same sandwich as cheese, egg, bacon. But man, oh man, that's like two totally different sandwiches. Like it really well, is. Here's my thing: is like the McDonald's one. That's the only one I've ever eaten. So it tasted what it was supposed to taste like. It tasted like what I'm used to. It it's what good. I remember. Yeah. But the A and W one, it just feels oomphier in your mouth. The quality is just yeah. leaps and bounds better than McDonald's. By doing simple things like having more bacon and a bit higher quality of bacon and actually frying the egg. Like, I mean, we don't know for McDonald's sure. McDonald's fries the egg. Sorry, let me not say that, but we don't know for sure, but clearly based on this, like McDonald's will use those 
they, they use as a little, little circle form, thing. Which is fine. Like, the egg's an egg. It's still a fresh <clears throat> egg. But wow. this one, just having it sort of like where like it looks like they just put it on a pan and kind of flipped it themselves. Yeah. It gives it a little bit of a homemade touch. Yeah. It does. And it's cheaper. And it had like three that's times the thing. It's the 20, most bacon. 20 cents doesn't sell like much, but that's a huge difference in savings for how different these sandwiches but are. But here's another thing. Now I know why a and is more calories because it has more bacon. Oh, exactly. Yeah. So, I don't know, this might be a pretty, well, I think it's a pretty easy conclusion, but let's, uh, on the count of three, hold up the sandwich that we like best. One, two, three. Hands down. A&W by a and W by a and W. That doesn't mean to compare, like, that wasn't even funny. The two of them side by side, like. There's no reason to get the McDonald's one over the A&W one. No. I mean, you guys are very <laughs> adamant. I mean, I'll still go to McDonald's when they have two for five dollars because this girl's cheap. Well, but that's but... <laughs> two for five bucks and uh, we'll talk. <laughs> uh, but let's celebrate A&W because they did an amazing job. So three for three for Good you guys. Good job, A&W. They wouldn't remember the A&W uh, no. bear. A&W root bear? <laughs> No. <laughs> no. But on that note, you guys, that's it for today's video. Thank you so much for watching. If you guys are enjoying this content, please don't forget to like, subscribe, and share. We will see you in the next one. Here comes some bloopers. YouTube and Jill. Bye. Bye. Guys. Yep. McDonald's. Ver no, you are looking. I'm looking now. McDonald's versus A and W. Who did? You stole my line. An egg McMuffin from McDonald's. Mm. Should I give the price now? That is effing rare. Effing rare up here. <laughs> <laughs> Googlebot's listening.